Simon says, subscribe and click on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hi there everyone and welcome back to another lesson. In this video we'll be learning how we can use a simple function to calculate the days between different dates. So let's get started. The very first thing we're going to look at is the format of the date, month and the year given in Excel. In this case, I am using the format of month, date, and year. In order to calculate the total number of days, you are going to first of all select the cell where you want your total number of days to appear. Then in the formula bar, you're going to type the function of days followed by bracket open, and then the end date, which is this one in this case, followed by a comma, space, and the start date, and then bracket close. As soon as you click enter, you're going to see that the total number of days between these two different dates will appear. You can drag down the same function for as many columns and rows you want, and you're going to see that the number of total days is going to appear. That is a simple function that can be used effectively and effortlessly to count the number of days between two dates. Thank you so much. See you in the next lesson. If you're not a subscriber, click down below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. To see the full course that this video came from, click over there. And click over there to see more videos from Simon Says It.